Hey everybody, how is it going? Mr. Rager Engager, Greg here today, and today I want to make a, just a nice shout out video, just how excited I am, finally partnered. I mean, I have been, you know, <laughs> wishing for a partnership, having a raging heart on for a partnership for so long, and I finally got partnered with Shinma today. Um, it's kind of been a two-week process, I mean, I thought it'd be quicker, like the whole full screen application was quicker. I mean, Cassandra got back to me like super quick, you know, super quickly. While Luke, which is a guy from um, Machinima, it took him a little bit, a little longer, you know, to to get back to me and to reply and give me the materials. Which is cool though, because I imagine that he has a lot. Look at me get up this ladder. Ladders have been my worst enemy, like always. I'm always terrible at getting ladders. Nice bitch. Anyway, <laughs> yeah. So the whole um, partnership process with uh, full screen was actually easier, in my opinion. It was definitely quicker, but I just couldn't deny a machinima partnership. I mean, I'm a new, relatively young, new, you know, channel. I, I couldn't turn around and, like, deny the, uh, you know, the opportunity of joining machinima. I mean, I just always loved machinima. I was always like, man, I gotta join him. I gotta join him. And I finally did, and here I am. Anyway, today, um, I kind of want to talk about that and the differences between machinima and full screen. I'm not going to go into huge detail because I don't, I'm not allowed to really talk about the whole machinima aspect anymore because I'm officially in their contract and in their contract, even though I'm not even supposed to talk about what's in their contract. So let me just say, if I was a person who was recently partnered, the machinima contract would probably say something along the lines of me not being able to disclose their agreement. <laughs> you know, if I was a uh, recent partner you know I'm just saying if if you know it happened to be that I was partnered the contract might say that <laughs> anyways it's basically the whole partnering process what I'm talking about not the exact details um, and of course the money involved which is a big deal for a lot of these people when I think first of all though I should say don't really focus too much on the money as much as you want to focus on your ability to grow that's the important thing at least in my, in my opinion you know, everyone's different, but um, personally, in my opinion, I rather focus on the ability to grow. Jesus, that century gun, versus you know, just just making all kinds of cash and just because I know about the money. Personally, I mean, I, I have a job, I have another job on the side, so I have basically two jobs, and I'm in school, and so I have financial aid money as well. So I'm not like just struggling. But um, this is kind of cool thing to have. I mean, play some games and make some money off of it. So the initial partnering process between Machinima and Full Screen, generally Full Screen is going to have you with. You're not going to have to have these huge, this huge intense channel. Um, I'd say definitely 400 plus subs, you know, of subs. Um, you know, getting the important thing is 2,000 views a day. I don't know if you are getting less than that or more than that or whatever. But the important thing is to have 2,000 views, maybe 1,500 views a day. That's a big thing. They want to have you grow. They want to have a person who's going to be growing and not just someone who has, you know, a couple few videos up, but, you know, not really definitely growing from it. Same for Machinima. They want people who are growing. That's the important thing. They will take someone with lower amount of subs. And, I mean, initially, Machinima was the best of the best. You know, IGN, of course, is the best of the best. But, you know, Machinima would grew and just... All the people partnered with Machinima were these big boys, you know, with 2 million subs, you know, Chris Smooths, X Jaws, you know, just all these big guys are partnered with Machinima, and then all of a sudden they're starting to move. And they're moving on to, you know, potentially IGN, but most likely full screen, you know, and that's cool. So that gave me and smaller channels like mine the ability to step up and have, you know, our stuff put up on there. And so I thought that was exceptional. But. I say personally, growing, I chose Machino just because I thought that it would be, it's an initial three year contract, and I think it's good to have me doing this for three years and, you know, just coming through and selling everything down. But I'd say a benefit of full screen is definitely the fact that you can, you have your own kind of, um, it's like a video dashboard kind of system. Look at me with this dragon fire. I think I recently prestige, so I didn't change it, and I was struggling with it. <laughs> anyway, I um, there's this this dashboard, which is so sick, and you can send messages out to other full screen people. You can have you can email them, have them check out your video, 
you can um, you can link with different uh, you know if you wanted to be sponsored by some sort of company like a smaller company I don't know about Elgato or any of these larger companies or you know scuff controllers or something but no I mean like you know you can be sponsored by a smaller company a smaller startup and that's not something that Machinima offers I mean I kind of wished what was my teammate doing right there he was like in the cuts <laughs> just popping out on a brother anyway and so I definitely would if you guys are looking for kind of partnerships or just just getting your name out quicker I don't know maybe maybe full screen will work for you but I just couldn't turn down a machinima partnership I mean it's gonna be great for three years it's gonna be tough I'm sure I'm gonna run into some issues and some jerks and some assholes but whatever you know I'm I'm if I'm machinima partner I joined the club and so I'm definitely excited about that I encourage you guys to just get involved in the discussion that's what I really want that's the biggest thing even if this video gets 100 views but has 100 comments <laughs> i will have made my day you know that's what i want i don't want this little bitch over there <laughs> i don't want this video just to get no comments or whatever you know i want you guys to get involved in the discussion let me know um what your questions you have about a um, machinima versus a full screen partnership please let me know a little bit easier to interact with your questions than versus making a video about it um i know there are going to be some things that you guys are going to want to know from a person who's been there and done it and I can answer your questions as best of my ability. And so, once again, guys, it's Mr. Rager Engager. Greg with Mr. Rager Engager. I'll let you guys know that there are two people on this channel. There's Greg, moi, and my one of my closest friends, uh, Ankit, who does a lot of the gameplays. This gameplay is mine. He's going to be doing a lot of the Xbox gameplays just because my parents are tripping nuts about me playing on the Xbox. They're like, whoa, no, no Xbox in the house. Get your heart down. I'm like, dudes, I'm in college. And I understand that. I mean, I moved back home because I was paying $20,000. This is for another video. This is just going to end this here. But just as a recap, I was paying $20,000 for living on campus. And I was just like, I don't want to pull out a loan. I'm just going to chill at home, live at home, drive to um, uh, campus, of course, for school. And it's been cool, but the transition has just been tough as far as the gaming. Parents just hate video games. They just have some crazy just hatred towards it. And so I've just been trying to manage this partnership, manage this YouTube channel while living with parents who hate such a thing. And so I'm going to be making a series on it, um, some tips on how to deal with parents who hate uh, video games and how to still make some money and how to have a, almost have a living off um, you know YouTube while not being allowed to play video games but anyways guys thanks for watching that's for another video stay tuned uh, Mr. Rager Gager 